guys it is a wednesday today and we're heading out to fifi island but well, i'm going to grab something to eat for breakfast and i'm going down by myself because my friend she's getting ready and she's not gonna um have breakfast but i have time so i need to like eat something basically so i'm gonna um grab something quick to eat there's probably some fruit and then grab something light and drink like a cup of tea and something but today we're going to fifi island we're gonna be there for the whole day today so that should be really good see the sun is like out now we barely get sun since we're here because it's been so cloudy but the sun has come out because we were a bit worried like are we gonna get to go to Fifi Island because the weather app was saying that it was gonna rain but it's all good it's all good I'm in like a green bikini and this cover up but I'm gonna put on like another cover up when I get to the island because that cover up is a bit more skin out so I put on this I can actually wear there I have like my tote with like a towel and a few bits that I need for the day in there. I'm not too sure where we stopped off last night. But last night we hung out in the lobby for a few minutes. Or oh, you might call me. Wait. The local driver. Wait. Because if my come up. I may have got on. Thank you. Morning. Morning. He's there. <laughs> in that local car. So um, what was I saying? Last night we had dinner. Oh yeah, I showed you I was having dinner last night. We didn't end up having the chill and grill because they already grilled the stuff, like the lobster and stuff, and they have it out. So we're like, let's just order something from the menu. So I ended up ordering like fish, and they gave us like cider rice, right, which was like really good. But after a while, my food get cold like so quick because I'm waiting for my friend food to come out, and then oh yeah, so noisy. Waiting for my friend food to come out, and then because you're sitting close to like you know the sea, the pool, whatever, it gets get cold so quick. But it was really nice regardless and then we just went in the lobby chill for a little bit and we just went up and we are pretty much up until after two last night so i haven't mentioned but our driver is coming to pick us up around eight o'clock and now it's around 7 40 so we'll have maybe like 20 minutes they're always early as well so they probably come a bit earlier than that so we'll have about 20 20 15 20 minutes to like grab something quick to eat which is enough time for me because um, you know, say I have to eat something because otherwise I'm going to turn into one different person. Anyways, we have a new breakfast. That is the menu. We have to open restaurants in here. I'm not sure if I show you. So you have like that one. You have Italian upstairs. You have like a cart. Um, over this look where I'm going to be going now. And yeah, breakfast seemed to be a bit empty this morning because people normally come out at like after 10 that sort of time so it's very early breakfast i got like a um latte with oat milk and the lovely cv that we have The noodle, maybe and mm -hmm. I mean the tour is simply to be confirmed. I would like to do myself. My name is Ray. Ray uh, Y. Uh, the boat is raining for the green seeker. Me, my captain, the crew, we are four people. Take care of you today. Uh, let me sit in the backside, rain a little bit, start, ladies and gentlemen. But before we leave, I have some questions for lunch. Uh, we stop at Pippi Dawn. Someone vegetarian, show your hand, please. Vegetarian. Vegetarian. Vegetarian food? Vegetarian? Ooh, you, me. What were they again? But I don't know because we said that bamboo island. So we're on one of the other islands to do snorkeling. So I have like my my goggles. I'm gonna like do it for a bit. And then just to see like what's under there. That's all. So, like in the blue bit there. It's in Peru <laughs> oh Hello. My wife, by mistake, put in my bag a cream to shave. Oh. To shave. Not. Do you want some cream? Yeah. Do you have yeah. I don't know why it's on this life vest. No. A miracle. 
We'll put on this glass yes, I'm gonna get in the water yet. I'm definitely gonna be leaving here with a ton. I have to give this guy my um sun cream because his wife put shaving cream in a bag. This older white man so me give my sun spray the way him probably be able to burn up. So I'm gonna jump in probably like literally a couple minutes, wet up myself as well. I'm gonna leave my bag and this camera. So I actually attempt to do snorkeling. I was explaining to you guys what happened with my little snorkeling situation but for some reason there is no audio on this part of the video i don't know why but anyways i went into the water and i was like okay cool but meanwhile i'm going into water i'm like why is the blue part so far <laughs> i didn't actually know that the blue part you know the blue part that i showed you guys before that that's where i need to be going to snorkeling it was so far and then to get there it was so deep my feet couldn't touch the water and then I give it a try. I was doing a little swimming thing. Guys, I can't swim. I can't swim, but I was doing something. And then after I realized, I was like, I'm not getting to the part where I need to get to. So I was like, okay, F this shit. I'm getting out. I'm getting out. But we tried. We tried to do snorkeling. Next time we go on a holiday, we're going to make sure that we know how to swim so we can actually experience the things that we need to experience because this is holding me back. But I actually did try to get down there and do some snorkeling, but it was just way too deep for me. And it was just going to be a little bit too irresponsible for me to try and get out in the deep just to do some snorkeling. It was a no for me. <laughs> Currently at Pidon, we stopped to do no snorkeling, but of me, it's the deeper end, the deeper part of the snorkeling, so jumping out all sorts. So this is not for me. So I'm just on the the top, not the top end, but the front of the boat, just looking out. I'm too ready to like go to Hilton. Is it Hilton? I had one of the two of them. We're gonna stop off to eat. Um, holiday in that's it we're gonna stop off to eat before we head off again Not my curly bits falling out. I can't see anyone from my group, so I think I'm probably gonna like make my way now. I've been taking photos with my tripod and stuff. So I just feel like sometimes they came out, they come out a little bit better when I take them myself. So I'm gonna probably go around the pool now and relax there for a little bit. They are small, long tail. Hmm? Hmm? We go there, take a picture, everyone. No swimming, huh? we go there and take a picture, but swim, we go swimming at the lagoon, okay. PB lane, PB lane. You see PB the one, we on the island, we went snorkeling, we went for lunch. Uh, don't touch the monkey, you know? I mean, they are white animal, real animal, we want. But they see the people every day. I want to see you another monkey. And it is literally so soft and feels so nice on your foot like so so nice oh i'm 
in the shopping mall. I'm here to grab some KFC because we're hungry. So I'll ask the driver if he can let me off. So, oh my God. So we left three feet. So the driver literally bringing, bringing up, taking us back. And when I tell you that the ride back from the island was a bit mad, the ride was a bit mad. It was just KFC. Like the waves were just very crazy. And it was just rough. But my tell you, everybody are all on for their life. <laughs> so we made it safe. Everybody alive. I know uh, I'm about to get some KFC because I'm hungry. Yeah. 159. Yes, I will do that one. So I'll do two. Yeah. In here? No, we're going to take away. There you go. Thank you. Mm. This is quite good. We're at Black Ginger Restaurant and the guy there waiting for a ride. So when you see that guy come in there, he has to like pull us across to the other side. Restaurant is so cool. Hey, I'm just a little time. We're at Coleman, but the name is Williams. I love it. It's an I. I, not an L. The way? I. The fortune people? Yeah. I. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Thank you. So I ordered the black the black ginger experience for a dinner tonight and it's gonna be a lot of food. If my I wish I showed you the menu because when I saw the menu I was like is this for like um I was like is this for one is this is this one people no I was like do I choose one main, one starter, but I get everything on the menu, which is a shitload of food. I think it was probably like about 15 options. It was a lot of options. So now I have like three forks and three spoons in front of me to eat everything. It also includes dessert, but it's small portion. But I'm really looking forward to like having it. I think it's going to be good. Fingers crossed anyway. Show you guys each other. I've got like a drink as well. So I'm like a mocktail. You can have with alcohol. I'm not really like a drinker like that, so I just got like this watermelon drink. It's really good, it's very refreshing. So the first meal came out. I can't remember what this is, but it's like a complimentary um by chef. So you're gonna get this to start. This is like sweet corn. I don't know what that is. Um I don't know what that is. <laughs> but this is what it looks like. She told me but I just can't remember. My appetizer is here, so it's like spring roll with sweet chili or hot sauce. And you have vegetable dumpling, you have a grill, no, prawn, and then I don't know what this is, but this looks really good. It is currently pissing it down, like look how much rain, crazy, like very, very hard rain. Anyways, my other meal is here. I think this is kind of like a salad, like a scallop salad or something like that. Listen guys, I don't be hearing what they're telling me I'm eating, but I just know that I'm just out here eating. But this is the salad, and then after this, I'm going to get the mains as well. So my main is here. This is obviously like a lot of food because I'm kind of full already. So this is like a rice. Um, I'm not too sure what this is, but I'm guessing it's full coloring for the rice. Um, scallop, you have red curry, fish, sweet chili prawn, and then you have some vegetable over there and this is this is the main i don't think i'm gonna eat everything off but i'm gonna try and eat as much as i can and this is my last dessert i got the other food to go because it was just too much so this is coconut ice cream with some different toppings on there and it's like one scoop of ice cream so we can bring this one down it looks really good though hey guys 
it's the next day which is our final full day in Phuket I'm just sitting I'm just sitting outside getting ready because we're gonna head out for like brunch at Tree Monkey restaurant which should be really good last night we had dinner at Black Ginger I did like film some snippets on my phone because like, my bag was too small to bring the camera away more I sneeze Achoo. bless me my bag was too small to bring the camera so I just filmed like some footage on my phone which you guys probably have seen um really good restaurant we came back probably like after one because we were there trying to get some pictures I didn't get any pictures because the lighting was shit it was like very dark in there but it was a really good restaurant the food was really good as well it was a lot of food because I ordered the the black ginger experience and you basically get like a bunch of different food which was nice so i still have food like left which i'm gonna pretty much have for lunch today i'm just gonna warm it up and have it today's kind of like one of our chill day as well i say chill that means we don't really have anything booked actually we do we have like a restaurant booked in the night for dinner but during the daytime it's more like go with the vibe type of thing so we're gonna go to one second there's an airplane i don't know how much you guys can hear because i'm outside as well so it probably be a lot of noise yeah so the plan for today is basically to go to three month restaurant after that we're gonna pop to Phuket old town to see if we can see like big buddha and stuff we haven't seen it so we're just gonna walk around for a little bit um and then after we're gonna come back chill a little bit at our hotel pool See if we can enjoy that too and then don't tell me some foundation done and then we're gonna um we have a restaurant reservation in the night for this really nice restaurant which i'm gonna like show you guys it's a restaurant called savannah you guys will see when i show you later but that's pretty much the plan for the day we haven't gone down to breakfast this morning because we wanted to like just do brunch type of thing i don't know what time is it it's like 11 49 now we probably should have leave out but um we just have to take with time and not rush because the past few days have been like you know back to back russian stuff so it's nice to just take our time and get ready and then just head out so yeah that's what i'm just sitting here doing just doing my makeup and i'm doing my makeup outside outside is very humid but the light inside is not that great so i was like let me just sit outside and do my makeup um, because my just calm but I would uh, the bad lights in anyway so I'm gonna finish getting ready once I get dressed then I'll show you guys my outfit and I'll bring you guys with me today as well of course my makeup is done I just need to like put some mousse in my hair get dressed and that's it just in case you're wondering this is the makeup bag that I travel with I got it from TK Maxx I have like my brushes and sponges here I have like eyebrow and lip pencils up there and then all the other rest of stuff like foundation concealer that sort of stuff in this side yeah i got it from tk max a while back and you can hang it up and it comes with like the little hooks here for you to close it that's what it looks like it's a really cute bag and i love that i have like the separate compartment where i put it in there it's from bky bky I am dressed and ready, looking all cute, like look at this tan. I'm gonna show you my outfit quickly. I was trying to like take some photos but my face is a little bit dark in this light and it's not really showing up with the light. But this is my outfit. You probably won't be able to like see it here but it's like this really long skirt with like this tube top and I'm just carrying this bag with it which is like so cute. And I have like a clear, like a clear heels on, and that is my outfit. We're currently at Tree Monkey Restaurant. We're about to like go upstairs. There's that music and shit, so you're probably not gonna talk in this video. I'm just gonna show you guys around. Okay, We're trying to like take some pictures, but none of the picture didn't come up with like the pose and everything is right, but the lighting is just very crap. Actually, I might try my camera with the pictures. 
It is pissing it down. We're gonna go to Big Buddha Phuket Old Town, but it's like raining now, so we're not gonna bother go. We don't really need to see. There's nothing much that we need to see. So we're just here, like taking some pictures, and then we're gonna head back to the hotel. Um, the pictures not come up, but I don't know what's wrong with the camera. When you take it, then it's like changing light. So I just, I'm just gonna use this and take some pictures hey guys so it is the next day i don't think i've like picked up the vlog yesterday and kind of update you on what's happening as you can clearly see i am back home in london i literally just got in and was like let me end this vlog because i haven't mentioned anything yesterday or ending the vlog yesterday so i'm here to like end the vlog and kind of like update you on like what happened yesterday so yesterday we went to tree monkey restaurant and we had a, such a nice time at the restaurant. The food was good. The service were really nice. Atmosphere was amazing. And it started raining when we were leaving. We decided to like go home because we had plans for the rest of the day. So the plans was basically for us to like go back to the hotel, chill at the pool for a little bit, and then get ready to go back out to this restaurant that we have booked. It's like a 13 course. We already like made reservation. We deposit like 2,000 Thai bots each. And once we leave Tree Monkey Restaurant, there was so much traffic. And we ended up getting back to the hotel probably like after 6, after 7, which was way too late. Our reservation for the restaurant was booked for 8.30. So you kind of see where me I go with this. So once we get back home, we realize that we're going to have to like literally rush to get ready and then leave out. So we're like, you know what? both of us were so so tired so we decided to just not go to the restaurant and we weren't super hungry as well and the restaurant is like a 13 course meal and we were like we're probably not gonna eat this much food because we've been going out and we have food from a couple nights before that we've been like taking away so we have all this food and then we're gonna have 13 course meal we'd rather lose the 2k than pay 6k because it was six thousand bought for like the 13 course meal we'd rather lose the 2k than pay an additional 4k just to not eat the food so we decided not to go we're pretty much just chilling last night because we were so tired our hotel to like warm up our food all of that and then just pack to come home and now i'm like back in london the weather is really nice it feels nice to be back as well um you know when you leave and you come back and the house is clean and it just feels nice you're like oh i can't wait to like sleep in my own bed tonight so that is the feeling my plants are also looking good because i'm coming here for look and i'm say let me see if my plant them good actually one of them look like it's a burn and one of them look like it i don't know what's wrong with my voice <clears throat> and one of them look like it's like grown a bit more the leaves are a bit greener which is quite nice also pick up like a few bits in the airport once we got to the airport we were pretty much just shopping around um and we ended up going ham um, i'm telling you and pick up like a few bits because i see someone i was like i want to try that 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 so i pick up some stuff i'm gonna show you I'm pretty sure I already show you the stuff that I picked up in Bangkok already. It's like this bowl that I got, I got from the floating market um, and the incense sticks. But incense sticks are currently in my suitcase. And these are all the stuff that I picked up from the airport. <clears throat> I'm going to go through and show you guys. I was struggling a bit to like open a bag because I kind of got stopped because of the honey. But I couldn't pull it. So... I don't know if I'm going to be able to now. Let's see. Okay, I'm going to cut this. Wait. So oh, let's do that. That was easy. Anywho, <laughs> I'm just going to like pick random stuff out and show you guys. So I pick up like these coconut wafers. Um, So got this. I'm really excited to try this. They have like a lot of coconut and mango stuff there. And like lychee and um dragon fruit like they have a lot of dry fruits in bags and stuff i also pick up this because it seems really good and this is like a coconut crispy roll and i can't wait to try this it have like coconut and strawberry with like chocolate around it so really excited to like give that a try as well i also pick up some coffee i don't know if this coffee is in like sachets um it says times 30 i think it might be little sachets i don't know it's like espresso so i pick this one up and then i got this coconut crisp and that's what that is looking like it's 100 percent fresh coconut and it's baked not fried i'm imagining this is going to be really really good as well 
Also picked up these mango flavored chewy candies, which I was like, remember mango sweetie from Jamaica? Like this is gonna be really good. That's what I was thinking anyway when I bought it. Let me see if I can open it. See what it looks like. Come in like these little um thing. Let me try it. I can't imagine it tasting just like the mango sweetie in Jamaica. I really love those. But this is chewy, they say. Mm. It tastes just like it, but it's chewy. Mm. Oh, I'm going to have a feast with these. These are really good. I don't want to like talk to you with the chewy in my mouth. So I'll go back to that in a bit. I also picked up this parmesan black truffle premium mixed root crisp it has like um sweet potato in there pure sweet potato yellow sweet potato orange sweet potato and taro and i've tried like beetroot crisp before um with like another different stuff in there and it's amazing so when i saw this i was like i'm probably gonna really love this so let me just pick it up and then I pick up some honey, which is kind of sealed, but I want to show you like the inside of the, the bottle because it's like, I'm going to open this. I make them seal me up, so do not cut here to open. Thank you, they will Anyways, this is the honey. You can see inside of the honey, I don't know, yeah, you can see. This is what the inside looks like. And I can't wait to like try this honey. I imagine it being like such good quality. It's 100% raw honey. Wildflower with the honeycomb inside. And I just know this is going to be great. And I don't know why I only buy one. But you know when you buy things where you're like, why did I not buy like more than one? Why did I just pick up one? And Thailand is so far away. But you can get only at the shop. But I'm going to take my time with this one. Because I just feel it's going to be one of them really good quality honey, you know. And I pick up some tea. So I'll show you the tea that I picked up. I really love tea. So I was like, let me just pick these up. So I saw my friend pick up this green tea. So she tried it and it's really good. She tried it at the hotel. So it's like a Thai. So I'm just going to give it a try. They were like 145 baht each, which was like pretty cheap. So this is like, um, so it's the original Thai milk green tea. And that's what that one looks like it says tastes similar to like a matcha type of thing so i'm gonna give that a try and then i picked up like a regular thai green tea that one whoops and then i picked up like a thai tea but it's like a mixed um i think there's like different thai tea in there i don't know it just say mix so i'm just guessing that's it and yeah, that's the one that I picked up. And I'm definitely going to give all of them a try and see how I like them. But yeah, those are all the stuff that I got from the airport. I'm really happy with like everything that I picked up as well. well and I'm so happy. And it weren't that expensive. Like honestly, if I was in that store for any longer, I would have spent all my money and take up every bit of everything that I could possibly take up. But um, I'm so happy with this. And the trip, oh my gosh, was amazing. I hope you guys did enjoy the vlog and get to kind of like experience it based off just watching the vlog. But it was such an amazing trip. I had such a good time in Thailand. The people there are so, so lovely. The hotels that we stayed at were super nice. Um, only the, the last hotel was a little bit far from most of the stuff that we wanted to do um, But that's fine. We just did the, the taxi was pop some of the places were a little bit over one hour The closest place that we went to was black ginger restaurant Which was such a nice restaurant, but I'll definitely go there in the daytime rather than the night Just so you can kind of see like the atmosphere and stuff But yeah, if you have any questions guys about the trip, do let me know leave them down in the comment section down below I'm going to see if I can do a separate video as well just to tell you guys if someone is planning to go to Thailand just to give you guys an idea of how much I spent on the entire trip. So um, from, my from my flight to my um, 
hotel to how much I spend on food to like how much I spend on like clothing stuff like that I'm gonna do a separate video so you guys can um, look out for that one turn on post notification bell so when I post that video you are notified and I'll be sure to catch you in the next one I'm super tired I'm going to like I don't know I'm gonna nap <laughs> I'm tired but yeah thank you guys so much for watching and I will be sure to catch you in the next one bye <laughs>